Hi. Okay, so uh, yeah, I'm pretty sure I haven't stopped shaking since I came in here because I'm that awesome with speaking. And I wore this shirt to try to make me feel cool and strong, but it's not helping at all. <laughs> And I probably won't look up from my page, just so you know. I'll start off though, because I cut this one, I've said it like eight times. 253 days ago, I began my first day at a new school. The nerves were high, and my shields were definitely up. I was so afraid of being alone. Then 252 days ago, I realized that there were no need for those nerves, those shields, or anything else. I was already a part of some ridiculously loving family. Each day since then, I've become closer and closer to many people in this small school, and it's made this senior year and my move here the most amazing decision I've ever made. There are many of you that I don't know well, but hardly any of you that I don't know at all, if any of you that is. The teachers, the coaches, the teams that I've been on, and all the students, I have a love for one another that's something that I've missed my whole career at school. This being the sixth school that I've been to since kindergarten, I can honestly say that it's been the most amazing so far. At all the other schools I've attended, I haven't even known my whole class, but now I'm here and I know the entire high school and that's, that's something special and just amazing. So first, two underclassmen. As everyone said, don't take this school for granted. It's the most special thing that you'll ever have. From the experience of public school, I know that things are much smoother when you actually know everybody and have a relationship with them. So I must say to you, keep your friendship, friendship strong and don't let arguments tear you apart because they're going to happen and they will be stupid. <sighs> Finally, Keep a check on one another. Don't let yourselves fall away from each other, like I just said, because a lot of things will happen and worldly things will tear into your lives. But as long as you've got a strong friend to keep you there and to keep by your side, you'll stay with God. Now to you juniors. You guys have been awesome. Uh, you're fun for laughs and you're fun just to be around. You're strong and you're close to one another, and that's what you need to be good leaders in this school. You have to remember to start off strong, though, and not just kind of mosey into it. Our class, besides procrastinating for everything else, we actually got a good start, and we got started early. So we've been able to have fun and make it a good year. So have fun, but uh, try to live up to us. Don't worry. You'll do great, but enjoy that. And uh, yeah, don't forget who you're around. AJ, every day, you're home. Do you go to the school? Yeah, next year, I'm not going to be here, so uh, try not to forget me. Now to the teachers. I haven't got to know many of you very well because I've been here for a year, but you've impacted my life a lot. Your good examples constantly shine through your actions. Coach Furrier, I have to personally say something to you because you've helped me get through everything. First person I knew when I came here because I've known you from when I was a little kid. But uh, you just, you've helped me, you've been a strong encouragement in my life. And you've helped me get along with everybody. And there's always going to be a special place for you in my heart. <laughs> <laughs> now, Miss Pillow, from the first day here, uh, yeah, I didn't know what I was to expect, but. You've made my spirits bright and every day started off good because you're always so cheerful and you just fill my bucket. <laughs> Each morning, no matter how much I despise English or all that grammatical stuff we have to do, I know that I'm still going to be happy and that I'm going to have fun in your class just because it's amazing. I'll definitely miss your sarcastic anger towards one. Wow. <laughs> wow. Towards Ryan Wade Morgan every morning. You put up with us all this year. Twice a day, I might have. Now to our sponsors. There's been a lot of words of thanks. There are a lot of words of thanks to go to you as well. 
as good as, as goofy as we are all the time, you've still done a great job with us, and you've kept the best spirits, and most of the time joined in with our fun. You've meshed with us so well, and everything that you've done for us has just gone perfect with our class, so we couldn't ask for a better group of people to be with us. You're awesome, and we all love you. Oh, and Mr. Ramsey, you're all right too, even though you get onto me all the time for shaving. It's partially my fault, but that's not the point right now. <laughs> but for real, you've been a really big encouragement to us, and like Morgan said, you've been a really good principal to us all, and I really appreciate it. Hey guys, this is your part. You guys are really special to me. These words don't do any justice to what you guys really mean to me. I came in 254 days ago, not knowing to what ex expect, expecting you actually all to be stuck up and just kind of push me aside. I didn't know what to do, <laughs> but that wasn't the case at all. I got there and we went straight to work, just as if I'd always been here. The greatest thing that night was definitely decorating the girls' bathroom with you guys, though. <laughs> I remember sitting in Miss Kello's class first period, and we just we didn't pay attention at all. We sat there and we looked at the girls' bathroom door because every girl that walked in would stop and just stand there. <laughs> Good times. <laughs> but yeah, there hasn't been a day where you guys don't make me feel like I belong. From the guys and our cross-country bus rides and all of our basketball trips and everything that we've done to decorate this school. You say I've been a good addition to this class, but well, there's nothing you've done that hasn't proved otherwise. I'm so blessed to be with you guys where each day I know that I'll be loved by every one of you. And if anything, if there's anything wrong, you'll always be there to try to figure out what's wrong with me and help me out. So guys, you make me laugh nonstop from making fun of Colby and Savannah to raves in the man cave. It's just nonstop fun. We've made the most of everything we've done, and we've accomplished a lot. Out of everywhere I've been, in all the years, in all the schools, there's never been a group of guys that have got along with so well. Girls, you're the most fun-loving, encouraging, strange, weird group of sisters. <laughs> but it couldn't be more perfect. You all care so much for one another, and that's special. Each morning, I know that I'm guaranteed a good morning, Garrett, from Julie, a hand hug from Rachel, and what's up, G-Dog, from Savannah Wilkins. <coughs> what a better way to start the day. You guys are the most amazing people I've ever met in my life, and I wish I didn't have to end it. I wish I could work things out where I could go back in time and I could have been here through all the years to experience all the other uh, memories that you guys talk about. But I can't, because I'm not that cool. But I am glad, because we've made a lot of all the memories that we have this year. And there's something that I'll never forget. I know we're going our separate ways, but this better not be the end of us. We've done so much, and there's so much left for us to do. I wish you all the best in whatever you do, and no matter what you may need, you can always know that I'm going to be right here willing to talk with you, be with you, or help you in any way that I can. You guys are the best brothers and sisters a guy could have. You've blessed me beyond imagine, and I can't thank you enough.